So welcome to the demo. This is our Taste of Heritage demo today. Based on that creative brief that Adobe provided us, I decided to take the classic spaghetti and meatballs and put a little twist on it. Yeah, rotini, little twist, you get the joke. So um, we are in a constant light situation. It's off camera, but it, we are using the, the panel, the LED panel. And because, as you can see in the background, we have some daylight coming in. It's not necessarily affecting what's happening on the table. But you can also see why, when we decide that we're going to want consistent lighting, that using artificial light is really helpful. So let me get started on this. We got this at a baseline. It hasn't been garnished yet. I like to garnish on set. I'm going to start with my parsley. The parsley that we had preserved is still nice and fresh. I'm going to go with a little parsley, and I like to be messy. I think that when I think about food at home, I don't really think about things being pristine. And it's certainly not in the family I grew up in, where everybody ate with gusto. So I'm a little messy, all good. Now I'm going to go cheese. And because my food has been prepped ahead of time, and it's not super hot, this means that it's going to last a little bit longer on set. This cheese is going to not melt right into the food. So that's really helpful as well. Now that I've got this, I've got a little bit of a mess happening. I'm going to go with a little red pepper. And my whole plate looks a little messy. I may drop a little bit more out here just to give it a little bit more life. And then I have one beautiful sprig that I can drop in the middle. Now, of course, I'm having a hard time with my hands. So I'm going to go and I'm going to get my chopsticks and just give it a little bit of a tweak so that that leaf gets where I want it. OK, that looks nice. I'm going to frame, and I'm going to shoot. I got the camera mounted overhead for this shot. I'm going to get up here and check it out. I really like where I'm at. And I'm good. I'm framed, I'm focused, and I'm ready to shoot. So I've attached a trigger release. And I'm going to take a few. So I know what I already have. I'm pretty comfortable that I got my overhead shot. I'm already styled, so I feel really good about that. So I'm going to take this camera down. I'm going to get this out of the way. I'm going to change my lens. I want to go to a macro lens. I'm going to go to a 50 macro so I can get a little closer to this. And again, I have either side raking light, three quarter light, or I'm going to shoot this way against the light. So I want to remove some of these things out of my space. All of those things feel pretty natural in the environment. So I'm in this space. I'm feeling really good about the light. I'm feeling good about the styling. I'm able to get a lot of captures here. I feel like I'm in my creative brief here. I'm in my taste of heritage. I'm telling my story here. I feel good about all of this because everything in this frame reminds me of the things that I grew up with, and that's why I want to be in this. I have some age on my tabletop. I have beautiful food, color, vibrancy, warmth, all of it. And of course, my light is exactly as I prescribed. Cross raking light. I don't really need anything on the back side because I'm dropping off to shadow. It feels great. So just a couple more. And I feel good. 